Here's a problem I've never ran into. Most of the time we have access to larger size lumber here in America. However, someone in Israel just purchased one of my stair building books and said that the largest lumber they have access to is a 2 by 8 now, if that's the case, I think I have a solution for you, um, even though I've never seen it used before. So use it at your own risk. Here is what you would end up with if you had to cut this particular stairway out of a 2x8. And you can see there just isn't enough meat on the lumber left where the back of the treads meet the bottom of the risers. I think you could actually cut a 2x6 and put it under the stair stringer, something like this, and I think you will be okay. Simply cut one for each stringer, and uh, you should end up with something like this. Now, you're going to need to figure something out to attach the stringer to the support um, underneath it, and I think a good, good fix for that would be plywood or OSB, and then make sure that you nail it um, good. Make sure you nail it uh, and by that um, maybe use some 8D nails with heads on them of course and uh, you know nail one every 16 inches on each side of the brake. Don't forget to uh, double check and make sure that uh, you, you nail it on the right side. You might not be able to use it on the outside of the stringer. It might make it uh, your stairway might uh, not work well with that. Um, you can see here that it's uh, we have one on each side on the outside stringers and two on the center stringers. You know, why not add a little additional support there um, by nailing what you can? So now there is one more thing I uh, thought of while making the video, and that would be to put a 2x6 underneath and then cut a two by eight for the side, something like this. If you need a little extra support, I think something like this will uh, provide you with plenty. You're basically making a, um, you're doubling the strength of the stair stringer of a regular two by 12 stair stringer, I should say, by doing something like this instead of um, just putting the one support underneath it. Anyway, I hope that helps and don't forget um, if you, and, and, and what I was going to say is you can do this to every stringer if you need extra support on each stringer. If you actually walk up the stairway and it feels flimsy, you know, it just doesn't feel that strong, then you can always build walls under the stair stringers like this illustration here. And again, this is obviously not to... You wouldn't build it for a four or a five step stairway, I doubt. But if you're building a stairway that's going to have about uh, 10 to 15 steps, then you might need uh, some additional support. And a wall like this just might provide you with that. So anyway, I hope this helps. Uh, remember that uh, I am not a structural engineer. This is just a uh, example of something I think would work. Um, so use this information at your own risk.